These days, we use our phones for way more than just making phone calls, and all that use means your iPhone's battery is gonna get some serious wear and tear. The batteries in iPhones and all cell phones are consumable products. In fact, the average iPhone battery retains only 80% of its original capacity after 500 cycles. To put that into perspective, if you charge your iPhone battery every night for a year and a half, the battery meter would still read 100% but your battery life would only last 80% as long as it did when you first got it. You know when your car needs a new battery because it doesn't start up, but how do you know when it's time to replace the battery in your phone? Here are six signs that it may be time to swap out your iPhone's battery. Number one, your iPhone often turns itself off. If your iPhone suddenly shuts itself down when the battery is at 50% or so, the calibration might be off. To calibrate your iPhone, follow these steps. Step one, use your iPhone until it shuts itself down due to low battery. Step two, plug your iPhone into a reliable charger and let it charge uninterrupted to 100%. Step three, once it's charged, perform a soft reset by holding your sleep wake button and your home button down until the Apple logo shows up. If you're on an iPhone 10, you'll be holding down the sleep wake button and the volume button. If that didn't solve the problem, the battery may be the culprit and you should replace it. What's happening is that lithium ion batteries have a voltage range in which they operate safely, and this is enforced by the power circuitry. As lithium ions age, their internal resistance grows. So when the phone does something processor intensive, it draws significant current. Pass this current through the increased battery resistance and you get added heat generation and substantial voltage drop. Number two, your phone feels sluggish. If you're using an iPhone 6 or later, you may be subject to CPU throttling. If you're running iOS 11.3 or later, you can check your battery health by going to the Settings app, select the Battery option in the list, and then select Battery Health under Peak Performance Capability if you see a warning that your battery health is significantly degraded, it's time for a replacement. Number three is an obvious one, your iPhone has terrible battery life. This is especially true with iPhone 5S or earlier. Earlier iPhones aren't affected by CPU throttling, so the only sign of a dying battery will be shortened usage times. Swap out the battery and you'll be boosting the battery life. Number four, your iPhone works, but only when it's plugged in. You might have thought your phone was completely dead, but when you plug it in, it magically comes back to life. Unfortunately, no matter how long you leave it plugged in, as soon as you disconnect the power cord, it shuts right down. Sign number five, your phone gets hot, like really, really hot. It's normal for your iPhone to generate heat during heavy use and charging, but if you notice that your phone's becoming too hot to touch, it might be time for a new battery. And lastly, your batteries got bloat. This can be a tricky one to spot, but you'll know it when you see it. Batteries can sometimes swell due to a failure of the smart circuitry or physical damage, like getting bent in your back pocket. You may start to notice some unexplained bowing or case separation along the sides of your phone, a hazy white screen, or even some squishiness when pressing down on your screen. In some more extreme cases, you might even see some unexplained screen cracking. No matter how you discover it, a swollen battery is something that requires immediate attention. The battery should be treated and disposed of properly as soon as possible. So if you're experiencing any of these battery problems, head on over to ifixit.com and pick up an iPhone battery fix kit. It's a super easy repair that you can do yourself in under an hour. I'll see you next time.